Pointer Eddians, welcome back to To the Moon. Got any um, ideas or theories yet? You want to discuss before we continue? As of late, um, they mentioned some sort of uh, problem with her. I'd imagine it's it's got to be something mental. So, what she's doing, I'm not familiar with. So, it's probably something, yeah. We're like almost halfway through his lifespan. So. I'm just curious. So, obviously something happened. Some accident happened that led to her change in mental state. Something traumatic or life-threatening, maybe. I don't know. Maybe a car crash? Car crash. Um, maybe. I I'm not sure. Was there a car crash? I don't know. I'm actually saying that because I, I actually don't know. I, I don't know. I'm just postulating at this point. Oh. Because something would have had to happen, something traumatic, mm -hmm. that might have been John's fault, To which is why she looks at him the way that she does when... Uh, this is where the house used to be, isn't it? The house that never should have been. I mean, really... What is it about unusually high and dangerous places that attract people? Acrophobia. Yeah. Well, basically people look at tiny-ass places and dangerous areas and certain places and say, Fuck it, I'm gonna build a house on that shit. That's how we get castles. Like the temple in, uh... Basically. Oh, hey. Oh, it's the backpack. <laughs> oh! Hey, the thing is on. The lighthouse is on. Is that why you approached me back then? Yeah. <clears throat> what about now? I suppose it's just part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too irrelevant now, but Izzy said I should tell you the truth. I shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. What? What is that, a hacky sack? Can you throw this as far as where Anya's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? River! Are you insane? Get away from there! Hmm. I think this memory isn't too far from the last one. You think they may be connected? Probably. Hmm. Something happened. He did something. To upset her. Ah, oh, that's the thing. Why did she cut her hair anyway? I don't like long hair. Nobody cares what you like, Watts. Fuck off. Hadouken! Alright, let's do this shit. Well, that was quick. Oh, easy peasy living greasy. No! Hit the wrong button. No. I'm dead. Activate memento. Boop. All right. Ah, oh, here we go. Time is kind of passing slowly. Everyone with it is different, John. Oh no. Is this where we find out what she has? Just because she and I share the syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. What? Ooh. But you must be able to help somehow. 
everything was okay at first, but now she's even more aloof than before. <laughs> even when we're in the same room, she's never really there. What? It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, but many of us do long for connections. <clears throat> Though being able to articulate articulate it is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it doesn't mean she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? <clears throat> Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. Apathy syndrome? That's a different reference entirely. Uh, Persona. Persona 3. One of the personas. That's pretty difficult to do, day in and day out. I know. Wait, but why do you seem so normal, Izzy? I mean, don't you have the same condition? For one, I was diagnosed when I was still young. With effort, it's not impossible to acquire a guise of social norms systematically. Ooh. But you know what? I both envy and pity River. So they must be sisters. Me, I'm an actress because I've been doing it all my life. Not only on stage, but off stage. And at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. It's the only way for me to be normal. Quote, unquote. But River, she never did that. She remained an outcast and refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if it was by choice choice or by limit, whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore, and then I realize that it's all too late. The Isabel that people know of is an act real me has long become a stranger. I think in the end, I just envy her. What? What does all of this mean? Huh. Never met a woman with it before. Then technically, you still haven't met one. This isn't part of our business. Let's move. I think that this is your the world could be easier on the eyes if people just remembered faces more. That's the explanation for why they're shadow people. No, yeah, I understand why they're shadow people, because this is memories. They're not going to remember every face that they see. Anything new today? No. What are you reading there? The Emperor's new... Oh... I loved this when I was young. Still do, huh? Of course. Just for different reasons. When I was a kid, I loved the Animorphs series. <laughs> oh, those are old books. I know, your mother gave you a book from it as a wedding present. Heh, yeah. That was one old wedding present. I guess I was pretty obsessed with it when I was a kid. Huh. Well, haven't you read them since? Hmm? I saw them. They're collecting dust in the garage. Well, I just grew out of them, I guess. I mean, they're children's books. So I'm with reading children's books. They're comforting. I suppose that's true. Hey! I think I'm going to get this one. Hmm. All right, let's see anything else over here. She went to oh. Oh? Oh. I guess we have to listen. I'm not yours, you're not mine, be my anti-valentine. 
Hey, River. This one's not that corny. River? But what about David's... He's my favorite character. Uh, I don't know. What are you talking about? Animorphs. Have you read it? No. Yes. Really? Sort of. Oh, oh, do you know what animal is David's main morph? Um... Blake! Don't look at me. You could probably just... You could guess, but... David? Uh... I... Rat. I, I literally died. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think that might be wrong. I think that might be wrong, Nathan. I like backspace. You don't. I think that might be wrong, Nathan. <laughs> that doesn't. That doesn't. Right. <laughs> I wanted to see how many spaces there were. Dude, that's my favorite fucking animal. Rats. Rat <laughs> Dude, I love rats. We're infested with rats. Don't worry, I'll find it out for you. No, don't. <laughs> No! <laughs> it's just gonna keep asking. Wait, there are three T's R A T T T. So five spaces? Uh I don't even know if you need all the spaces. I don't even remember what it is, dude. You're gonna have to find it find out. Mom? <laughs> he morphs into a mom. Right. <laughs> he morphs into a mom. Does that imply that he must first morph into a woman? And then No. And then quickly become pregnant and give birth no he he is a mom oh tobias hawk R rachel grizzly jake tiger marco gorilla david cobra c cobra casey wolf why oh just wondering you could have just googled it wait did google exist at this point when is what time Fuck. is this C O B R A. Oh, yeah, Cobra! I really wish they kept the old covers instead of these plain sheets. Those were cool. When your co worker is a piece of clothing, it's a Cobra. I'm terrible. Somebody, please kill me. Editing gun sound effect here. <laughs> I'm dead. Okay, we're back. Memento. I bet it's gonna be the book. Okay. Yep. <laughs> so many, so many buttons. Too many buttons. Oh, there we go. Thank you, middle piece. You never cease to me. No, no. <laughs> Data counter. Fatality. No. Animorphs. Activate. Oh, this must be their wedding. Oh, everyone's leaving already. But I just got here. Shut up, Watts. Seems to happen to you a, a lot at parties. Oh, burn. Oh, go save your childish jabs for the insecure. I am. Oh! The joke is that he's insecure about his life.
<laughs> okay. You can't hear me not laugh because I'm over here. <laughs> An aged Animorphs book. Oh, look! More pickled olives. I see Le Fromage, but where's the mouse? That's the corniest remark you've made all night. Don't you mean cheesiest remark? Bite me! Bite me, Watts. Let's see. I need an exit point. Ugh, is there an exit point anywhere? Now, let's go up here. Let's see if we can find more memories up here. Ha, oh, la dee da. All right. Doop da ba doop da ba doop da doop da doop. Oh, there's the arrow. Found it. <clears throat> Pardon me. Hey. Ha. Y'all gonna do anything? Huh. <clears throat> Was I supposed to do that? Do you feel any different? Now that we got the rings on, I mean. No. Why do you... Why do you? Actually, yeah, I think so. What is it like? It's just... different. It's the responsibilities, I suppose. Responsibilities. That's a big word. Do you like the name... Anya. I guess I never had kids. Would you like to name her Anya? I understand. Yeah, Anya's a good name for her. Hey, come with me. Hmm. Aww. This can't be a good idea. I'll probably trip and fall. Don't worry, just follow my steps. Too. Ow, my ass! <laughs> I think you stepped on my toes. Sorry! Come on, let's try again. <laughs> ah, yuppie newlyweds. How adorable. Promise to love and comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health. That's the important one. For as long as you shall live. I do. And do you take this man sent me for you to be your lawfully wedded husband? To promise to love and to comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health. For as long as you all shall live. Both shall live. All that jazz. Yes. Are invested in me, and I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Wiles. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> Act, the wedding. Uh, yeah, what do you think that was? I'm just bad at weddings, that's all. You're bad everywhere, Watts! Fluids tend to escape from my eyes. Oh, you're sappy! I didn't know you were that sentimental. Oh, did I say my eyes? I meant my mouth. And by fluids, I meant both fluids. 
and solids. That's a lovely image. Thanks, Neil. Let's find a way to get out of here. All this happiness and joy is really putting you off too, huh? No, I just don't like watching people make mistakes. Sheesh, whatever happened to just take it a moment by moment? Damn. Mistakes. The fuck are you talking about? <laughs> ah, here we go. Kick? But it's olive flavored. Oh, I'd better go see how your aunt is doing. Alright, Ma. Tell her thanks for coming. I will. I'm so proud of you, Joey. Joey. Oh, that's my grandpa's name. He passed away before I was born. Ma calls me by it as my nickname. How come you never told me about it? Because I'd rather you call me John. Eh, not another sentimental grandparent childhood. Now, what do you have against those, anyway? I mean, you sure talk about your grandfather a lot. What? No, I don't. Whatever you say. Receive a note, Joey. Alright, one more. Talk to her. I'm so proud of Joey. Oh, that's what she says. That's why she's not talking about it. Fos! Let's see. Not only do I have to find another memory thingy, but I also have to find the exit. Yeah, boy. All right, we're going to conclude here. So uh, thanks for watching, and maybe I'll be able to find the next part next episode. So uh, until then, stay interesting.